Sanctuary Entrance. This is not a long chapter, not one bit. Fate has played its hand, and now the die is set. I knew this child would play her part somehow, and it seems Gabriel has real help at last. It bodes well for our quest. The golem that protects the girl has something that could prove very useful in the end, something unforeseen. My dear friend, I see your destiny before me, and it is terrible indeed. And yet I have trust that all will be as I have hoped. So what is it he's hoping? I'm not going to give away spoilers. What do you guys think? For thousands of years, this city overflowed with life. It was a sanctuary of magic, wisdom, and harmony. These people were the ones that created the crystals, which you've already seen. They didn't need armies for protection. Their powers were enough to thwart any threat. That is, until the Lycans came. Then the balance changed. Trolls, goblins, gremlins, creatures of nightmare besieged the city endlessly, day and night. Most fled. Others used their remaining powers to create huge titans to fight against the invaders. The battle lasted centuries until there was no stone left standing. No one left. Those that did not die in battle were captured and devoured. My father was one of the last. He hid me. He created the Black Knight to be my protector. We have been running ever since. The Titans outlived their creators and stayed here fighting against an enemy that outnumbered them until even they were defeated. All except one. Behind those doors awaits the last of those Titans. The only way to reach the Sanctuary of the Dark Lord is through that door. We will have to defeat the Titan if we wish to continue our journey. The door will only open with the power of a crystal. You need to find four shards to create a whole crystal. We will wait for you here while you look for them. Go in search of the areas where the crystal shards grow. We will wait for you here. Oh fun, this is the level that has the Titan fight. Titan fight is very, very poorly designed for computers if you don't have a controller. You'll see what I mean when we get there. I'll even probably point it out. You're not supposed to dodge my dagger. How dare you! Easily capable of destroying entire cities. Our future does not look well. Okay, almost did not get that. where crystal shards grow are purple in color. You need four shards to create one whole crystal. Ah, there we go. You found a crystal shard. We need three more now. 
almost space that that one was there. As you guys have no doubt noticed, I've played this game once before coming for the walkthrough. Uh, at this point, after you repel up here, you want to run backwards towards the screen. You have a light gym right here. It's always fun to do those little jumps. Ah, <laughs> oh, there was a light gym. There was a gym over that way. Not a gym, I mean Remember, a Remember, we still we need three, three more, more crystal, crystal shards. shards. <laughs> yeah. I remember. <laughs> camera. I, I'm gonna so say that was the camera, because that technically was the camera. I do not want to run off the edge again because of the camera. <laughs> Remember, we still need three more crystal shards. Let's continue forward after that fight. <laughs> fail jump. Fail jump, yep. That was an epic fail on my part. There we go. Eh, camera randomly switched. Perfect timing for a troll to spawn, you say?
Okay, so what happened is I by accidentally skipped one of the shards. Eh, humor. And, uh, so we need to backtrack towards... There is the only end. one shard left. left. You just you need just one need more to create, create one whole crystal. crystal. Where we picked up the light gem. So... Yeah, sorry about that, guys. It's also where a shadow gym is hidden. And, uh, an upgrade. So head over this way. Just telling us what dark crystals do, basically. What the crystals that we're collecting do. Now come back here. Do not waste the crystal or you'll have to find another one. Okay, so here's the upgrade. You need a, the stake upgrade for your weapon to be able to get to it. It is a dagger upgrade. Come up here for the shadow gym. Is right here. And there's our fifth shadow gym. So now we have shadow magic right up with the uh, light magic. Quite useful. Look at that, it's easy to backtrack.
Yeah, you need to grab the shard before heading in here, or you're gonna run back. Have to run back. Behind that big door, the Titan awaits you. These statues seem to be here for a reason. I think these statues can move somehow. Basically, we can pay to get the, uh, how to do the puzzle. But I don't want to pay to be able to get that information. I know how to do the puzzle. No. Wrong way. There we go. Good work, Gabriel. Get my shirt back. Oh, it's not cool. Guess we don't get the shard back. Oh well. Oh yeah, I did lower the difficulty, like I said, on Saturday the 13th update. The last couple videos didn't have that because that was actually before Saturday the 13th when I made the decision to lower the difficulty. And like I said in that video, it was just because of all the glitches I was running into, I was getting very frustrated and unable to kill things. And as you noticed, really nothing changed. Anyways, that's all of the upgrades and stuff for that one. And I'm sorry I got it wrong for when we fight the Titan. It's the next level, not this one. 